But as in every community, there are issues that cause stress and anxiety in children. And these are referred to as ACEs, or Adverse Childhood Experiences. And they include neglect, abuse, and a dysfunctional home environment. And these stressors can affect kids well into adulthood. Take a look. Families and stress. Stress and kids. Stress that can follow through to adulthood for the rest of their lives, harmful both mentally and physically. Now experts have better identified high incidence of stress in kids and call them adverse childhood experiences or ACEs. Studies draw a direct line from ACEs to poor performance in school and then as an adult, more substance abuse, higher rates of diabetes, heart disease, and depression. ACEs are so common that there's a high probability that you or a loved one have experienced ACEs. And each additional ACE increases the chances of future health problems. Some kids live in situations that can cause toxic stress, where an excessive activation of the stress response system leads to wear and tear on the body and brain. How many ACEs have you had? What's your ACE score? There's a survey you can take to find out. Now, what if your ACE score is higher than expected? Don't panic. There are ways to reduce the effects of ACEs. Of course, the place to begin is to reduce the stress in adults and kids, especially kids. There are ways to build resilience in children. Nurturing relationships, building social connections, and improving parenting skills. All easier said than done, but there is help available and recognizing ACEs can start the process of healing and a better life.